Well, it appears that this might be the end of the line for the tens. Make sure you guys smash the crap out of that subscribe button so you guys don't miss out more awesome content. We have the limited Ashizu Run Field Center down below. I will link it so you guys can grab it today. So, there's been a couple of interesting rumors that I'm hearing that have come down out of a few locals and from what I've been told from other people from some distributors across the U.S. that these Megatons are it. There is no more Mega for the Tens. Now, you're probably like, well, I mean, that no more tens like how are they going to do reprints like you're, you're probably like oh, that's that's bad news well here's the thing all right maybe this doesn't mean an entire end to the mega 10 run itself it just means a particular end to the pharaoh series now if you remember the last like three to four years of tens has been all about you know like basically original Yu-Gi-Oh at this point in time you know they basically milking the original franchise for what it's worth so now that we're done with this era maybe what they're talking about here is we're done with this block now we can go into something else no no maybe we can rebrand the tens at this point in time but I've been hearing this more and more out of more people that the tens are done you know like uh, next year 2023 there's nothing slotted coming down from that and I've heard this from a couple of LGS's now too so I'm very curious about you know going forward here how they will handle reprints because I, I don't foresee them totally you know amputating things but the loss of the promos definitely made people a uh, very upset all right that value that those created were a little bit rough it'd be nice if they could go back and reimagine those things you know instead of maybe cluster dumping all you know these huge sets in here maybe something a little bit more specialized or a little bit more special i do like the fact that they can mix up rarities within the tins here and make things a little bit better a little bit you know different in terms of upgrades but the tins have always been that centralized reprint set every year and if konami really is looking at you know getting rid of this product that's going to leave a big hole in the community where expectations need to be filled they really do if they're planning on going forward here with like GX product, you know, for example, now that we're done with this era, they really need to look at bringing back those. So that's the current discussion point that I'm hearing coming down that tins are done. Um, do with that what you will. I don't have any more really to elaborate on that because, you know, word of mouth is always going to be one thing, you know, versus something else. And, you know, considering the fact we're getting the Dark World Structure Deck, we might not even get a Ghost from the Past next year, you know. I can definitely tell that Konami is changing up the structure of product for 2023 based on current releases. And I think that's a good thing, ladies and gentlemen. But alas, it's definitely going to open up the door to, hmm, what are we going to do? Please leave a comment down below, tell me what you guys think, and I'll see your beautiful faces back here later in the day, guys. Peace. Thank you so much for watching. Check out these other videos.